Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. One of the easiest blitzes to set up in the game, and it's going to change your defense on third down. Coming up next. Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus, the only YouTuber that gives you full games of all the tips and schemes I show on my channel. I'll show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. All right, so guys, if you're new to my channel, make sure there's a subscribe button and also that notification icon so you can never miss an upload. Uh, previously, I actually showed you uh, a plus one blitzing concept uh, out of the nickel normal, uh, which was a man concept. Uh, and I actually had um, someone use the splits against me, and um, I it was it was I was having a hard, hard time with it. Uh, and this is one probably one of the easiest blitzes to set up and it will get you pressure and it will catch your opponent off guard if you mix in um, other plays within the nickel formation and give your opponent the same look. It is the over Overlord 3 seam blitz. Very popular blitz. The blitz has been used for years in Madden. But now, since the patch, it's made it into an overpowering blitz that is going to uh, basically screw up the tackles, blocking assignments, and give yourself pressure off of either one, one of the edges, and it goes against a blocked running back. So we're going to flip this play. We're going to flip it off to the right-hand side. We're going to use the overload three seam out of the nickel normal, and we're going to use this against random uh, random uh, pass plays, uh, uh, gun, uh, gun plays by the computer. All right, so this blitz is extremely easy to set up. We're going to use her, our middle linebacker, and first we're going to base a line. The next step is we're going to go ahead and take our linebackers and hit the right bumper and push them in. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our defensive line and pinch them in and then crash them down by hitting uh, down on the crash. And then you're going to take this guy and you're going to hover right over this left tackle and this is where the magic happens. Now I don't know what the computer is doing. These are all random plays but I want to show you how uh, the this, this blitz will come in, sick off the edge and mess up a blocking. You can see right here, that guy comes comes off the edge. The computer made a good read, but let's just show you how naked this is. So watch this guy just come flying off the edge, completely unblocked. No blocking whatsoever, and he's going to come in clean uh, right to the quarterback. And you can see right there, the pressure just comes straight in off that play action. Base line, pinch, pinch, crash down. Hover over the left uh, left guard, and you're gonna hold that right trigger button. And you can see he just comes blazing in, and I'm able to go ahead and get myself a nice little uh, right there. So we're gonna base the line. We're gonna go ahead and take our defensive line, shift them down, pinch our linebackers, crash the defensive line down, and we've got the blitz set up. Optionally, you can go and press. One of the things I like to do too, if I want to play with the coverages, I'll go ahead and take uh, my, my defensive back in the left screen, put him in a cloud fat, flat, flat, and actually take my safety and put him into hook curl. So in other words, that takes away any kind of uh, fast routes over the middle, right in the seam where uh, usually is going to be where people are going to go ahead and try to get, get after you at. And you can see right there, pressure comes in. Uh, he's got to make a fast read, which he did, but it, this is just a very easy blitz to set up. So guys, uh, go ahead and pay attention to my channel. Um, I'm going to be going ahead and running this uh, blitz uh, in third down type of situations, probably in a no huddle type of situations. I have this in my back pocket, uh, but it's a good way to go to get pressure off your opponent and catch him off guard. So to my subscribers, thank you for your support, guys. Make sure if you do like these type of tips, you go ahead and smash that like button. And once again, until next time.